Welcome back everyone, Criminal Archer here, time for some more Project Zomboid, and uh, annoyingly, and I don't really understand what is causing it, our character woke up again in the middle of the night, freaked out about stuff. I don't know why this is happening so much lately, I think it might just be bad luck, um, but it's very annoying. So, so we're going to have another day of not sleeping properly, I'm going to go ahead and... Um, the can only pour out half oh because it's not full huh. that's interesting I didn't know that didn't realize that was how that's gonna work okay that's cool <clears throat> all right I desperately want to get into the other bit of the storage area today and that is going to be our main goal Leave my book here, because I don't need that right now. And apparently I need more food. The amount of food that we got was not enough. Alright, uh, empty tin can. Actually, all this stuff can just go in the trash can. Trash can. There you go. Good enough. Alright, please give me four food. Make a... you know what? Make a bowl of cereal. Let's, see, let's use our cooking experience a little bit. And by cereal, I of course meant oatmeal. Because... Why wouldn't I? Alright. I'm very annoyed that we keep waking up. I repaired our pickaxe. It probably won't last very long, but it'll work it'll last for the moment. Um, this will probably be the last time it can be repaired. We've now we've now repaired it three times because the last I had to repair it twice to get it back into at least something resembling a usable condition. But that's okay. Things can't last forever, right? Those zombies will probably come around, but let them, I say. Be real careful here, because there's probably lots of zombies just lurking in these rooms. <laughs> In fact, I think I'm going to just poke my head in each one as we go past before I do any actual looting. So I don't want to be surprised. Alright, I think we're okay now. Metal sheets, metal sheets, and regular sheets! Just dumping those on the ground so I can pick these up and get them out of the way. That please. I don't know why it won't pick it up. Pick it up. There we go. Whoops. All right. What do we got? Suit pants. Spaghetti. Just just a massive number of books. Okay. I don't know what of those I need. Um, I'll take this one. I think, I'll, I think I'll leave everything else behind. I don't need any of that. Okay. More metal sheets. Random clothes. More random books. I want a living room set. There's a living room set. Metal work magazine that I have not read. Tip peg. This had tapes, right? Wasn't there tapes in one of these? Yeah. Danger in your bed. Space crew. Satin and silk. None of those are anything that matters. Okay. Um, give me a screen comfy chair, please in my way. Oh. I was hoping there would be a re repeat of, of uh, stuff on the other side. Yeah, I see you. Did 
hand axe I'll take. Don't need more crowbars. Planks and plaster. Yeah, they definitely made plaster more common than it used to be. Last time I tried to build a base, the uh, amount of plaster... Hey, another pickaxe. Nice. Um, trying to find all the plaster I needed was basically impossible. <laughs> I mean, we did it, but it, 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 it took some serious traveling to track down the stuff I needed. We don't seem to be close to water, so I'm not going to worry about the fishing stuff. Electric guitar, flute. We'll take one of these um, generators with us when we leave. Paint. Alright, so we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to bust this down again because I don't think the same key works. No. Did you break down half of that and then just go immediately to the other half? So that's definitely what it looks like you did. How did you follow? I just checked in here. Did I not see you last time? Wouldn't put it past me. I think that banging must be coming from in the laundromat. Doesn't seem to be happening over here. Alright, destroy. I'm just gonna work our way down and destroy all the doors first. Then I'll come back. Okay. Got that taken care of. It's another fitness contraption. Hand scythe, seeds, some boots. Magazine that I still have not read, okay. Thought I got all the magazines by now, but, or the specifically the, the mechanics magazines, but apparently not. More books. Folding chairs. Just some chairs. You know what? Let's switch to this denim shirt. Better than our lumberjack shirt. Spare engine parts, a bunch of, yeah. Or spare engine parts are always helpful when you're trying to repair engines. All right, we've done basically everything here. Now I just gotta find the closest one that actually has a generator in it because we're gonna take it home with us. There we go. This generator is for the gas station nearby. I think I said that already, but in case, in case you didn't catch it, this generator is, is to power the gas station for us once the power goes out. Hello, zombie. You know what, let's use a smaller weapon. Can you not get out off of that? Oh, there's more of you now. Cool. You know what I want to get since we're here? Where did you even come from? I want to get, um... Like a living room set. Like this one right here. This will work. A 
come back for the couch in a second. Yes, I'm already low on water. I think they, I know I mentioned it in the previous episode, but I'm pretty sure they, they up, they must have buffed, uh, high thirst. Or nerfed it? I don't know if you, if you count, if you call that buffing or nerfing when they make it more severe. So it depends on your perspective. Oh, I broke that. Okay. <laughs> Never mind. Maybe we won't get it. We'll bring some chairs home at least. I should probably keep the sledgehammer in here. Just in case I needed it in random places. Alright, I'm gonna take the uh we're gonna take the generator, the other generator down to the gas station. If you can fill a, a or if you can fill from a gas pump, like you can fill the cars from gas pumps. Where was that? There was a zombie wandering around. Okay, he's way over there. You can fill cars from gas pumps. I wonder if you can fill generators from gas pumps. Let's find out. So if I drop it like right here, can I? No, I can't refuel from gas pump. Um, and I don't have... Oh, I do have an empty gas can. Okay. You don't actually have to be next to things. They just have to be within a certain radius. So I'm going to drop it right here. We're going to connect it. We're going to refuel. Take fuel. How much does that add? It's 80% from just one? Okay, that's not too bad. Cool. I'll add the rest of this fuel to this guy. Yeah, I see you coming in there, zombie. Just wanted, I'd like to get this finished before this zombie gets here. Nope. Nope. Almost. There we go. <laughs> Just barely. Barely not enough. Yeah, I think there was a bunch of cigarettes in here I didn't pick up. Yep. Like that. Take them now. It's all money. Left money behind. So that's ready for the future. Well, I don't really like these random single zombies standing around. Especially not the ones that are inside my base radius. You doing, zombie? It's not your home. My home. Come here, you. Probably need to wander around the exterior here just to make sure there's not any more of these guys. Oh, look at that watch. Yeah. Massive amount of dismantling of watches soon. As I finish the, the book. Nobody there? Nobody there. Can 
Kind of feel like I should just like close up these doors. <laughs> We're not using those doors. We're using exclusively this this way to get in and out. So. Oh, uh, I need my I need my my new chairs. My new chairs. There we go. If I had a couch, I'd put it across from it. But we don't have a couch yet. <laughs> so we just have a couple of random chairs. It's fine. We have random chairs. Uh, sledgehammer. No, I, I ditched the sledgehammer. What is weighing me down so much? Oh, just random stuff. Uh, what do we have? You know what I want to do here? Can I let me attempt to pick one of these up? I want a crate for the roof. Looks like I got it. Place to put all this random, uh, car not carpentry, gardening type stuff. I added some more stuff as well. I don't know if I pointed that out before. Almost gone. I think, uh, I think the rain should come tomorrow. I think. Of course, I'm getting tired already. Stupid. Stupid sleep pattern. Alright, I read those two books or magazines. Let me just let's just knock back the rest of this bottle of vitamins. Mostly I'm just wanna get it out of my inventory. There we go. <laughs> also I don't need to hunt uh, eighty cigarettes, so let's uh let's dump a bunch of that. Fifty two is probably still too many, but it's better than 80. Because they're not... They don't weigh a lot, but they don't weigh nothing. 25. That feels better. Actually, let's see what the... Let's see what the radio has to say about the weather. Since we're getting close-ish to the weather time. <laughs> Maximum temperature of 30 degrees today. Cloudy spells. Oh, weather's bad weather's supposed to start tonight. Yeah, so so probably there might be a gap between then the ooh, very thick fog. And you throughout the day, expect showers or heavy rain, thunderstorm. There might be a gap between here and like a day or two. I might skip over a little bit while I uh, ride out the storm. But we'll see. Once we get uh, a little bit of skill, which when I'm dismantling the entirety of that warehouse down there should give us a, a, a chunk of skill. I'll start putting up some walls. We need to start subdividing this place up. Oh, you know what we can do right now? before we finish this episode, is let me leave this here. We're gonna go, um, get that antique stove. So that's important. Until we have the electrical skill to to bring in real ovens, this is gonna be the, how we actually cook things. It's over here, right? Yeah, antique oven. I still can't carry it. Okay. All right, can I carry it now? There we go. Man. Ditch basically everything to do that. Let me get rid of, let's get rid of this. I want to put it right there. Too heavy for inventory. All right, I'm going to have to, uh, we're going to have to set. Oh, I need a, ha I need a hammer to put it down. Fun. 
Um, let me just stick it in one of these crates for a minute. <laughs> I hear a zombie? Alright, I'm gonna have to run around the outside of this building. <laughs> Stupid zombies keep ending up inside the fence. Where are you? There you are. I just checked- I checked this like- like two minutes ago. Damn zombies. Alright, I've dropped basically everything. <laughs> so now I can install this antique oven. It's probably not going to be its permanent place because it's nice to have to be able to put this stuff like straight from the fridge into the oven without having to uh, move it. And I don't think we can reach both items. Yeah, I can't can't reach both the fridge and the stove from here, so we'll probably have to reshuffle things around. But that's the beginning. That's that's a start. All right, put this in here. Put this in here. Put the garbage bag in there for now too, just to clean up the floor a little bit. But yeah, so uh, we'll stop here. There might be a time gap, depending on what I how I f decide I want to handle the, the the thunderstorm coming up. Uh, but I'll see you guys next time. Thanks so much.